employees said they saw you stuff stuff from your basket into your jacket. I'll give you an opportunity right now to take everything out. But it's gonna be your one and only opportunity. If you take everything out right now, we won't even press charges, we'll just give you notice. I think that's a fair deal. Otherwise it's fair. All right, there we go. What it look like, TV? We are back. And on this episode, we're going to get back into that loss prevention specialist from out in Seattle that does a hell of a job at that arts and crafts store. Somebody else tried to get by her with a bag full of unpaid goods, and they didn't make it too far. Let's check it out. So I have, okay, you can leave this in here if you're gonna pay for all this. I have you on camera. Put it down. Sure. Sure. Yeah. Just you're just not gonna get another card. I can guarantee you, you're not gonna get it. Put it down. Let me see if I can grab it. She got a whole shopping bag full of stuff, trying to tell the lady that she gonna go to the car to get another card to pay for it. Like she just can't leave the stuff in the store. These people out in Seattle be on some dumb dumb stuff. Hello. We're open for about another five minutes. I'm going to go through your bag or I'm going to call the police. Let me. Well, she's not playing with you. Are you kidding me right now? Open your bag. I will. Get off of me, please. Open. Once again, like I mentioned in the other video, this is the real crazy part to a civilian. This lady is 100% in the wrong, but she is so, 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 so shocked right now that someone is actually willing to stop her from committing a crime. She really thinks that she was going to be able to walk into this store, take whatever she wants, walk out, and no one was supposed to put hands on her and try to stop or intervene or anything. She's about to try to play victim like the other lady, I could probably guarantee you. But this is crazy to me. You're bad. I'm not opening it. If you'll get off yeah, of me, this is all ours. Take it off. Get off of me. She's ripping off. that thing off her arm. Take it off. You can't just steal it. Bye. Get out. Go. Get out. Those are ours. Are you kidding me? Bye. What the hell is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? Man? Um, I'm doing my job. They're stealing from us. I'm going to grab my other hey. card. You're being yeah, okay. I am. Yeah, that's the two minutes to walk out with all this crap. You don't take your card to go. You don't take all, all the stuff with you to go grab your other card. You leave your stuff in the store and you go grab your card. That's a horrible excuse. But I remember back to my day, my younger days, and I was trying to shoplift and steal and all that dumb behind stuff. And if I would have ever got caught and somebody would have gave me an opportunity at the door, I would have gave everything back, said whatever I needed to say and got the heck out of there. It is really amazing. And this is how you know these people have no fear of going to jail. That they are just this casual and leaving after they done got caught. They should be running out of there. But she could care less when she leaves. She taking time picking her stuff up because she knows she's not in no trouble. We're going to have to start enforcing the laws on the books, people. This isn't going to work. Yeah. You're going to sit and go get another car that you don't Dude, have? I'm literally right That's out front. I was out looking. Bye. You are such a You cannot insult people like that. And she had the nerve to talk about you. You cannot insult people. That's what I mean. The nerve, man, the audacity. You went here stealing. But we done got things legislated to the fact that where people can't put hands on you. So everybody think it's okay to steal. But y'all tell me how y'all feel about that one in the comment section, man. What do y'all think we should do about this rash of shoplifting? I know one thing, it's not coming to the East Coast because we're not really with that. We want our Walmarts, we want our Targets, we want our Walgreens, we want our CVSs. So uh, you can keep them policies and you can keep that mind state out there. But y'all tell me how y'all feel about it. If you'd have made it to this point in the video, you are my MVP. It was a stone groove, my man. And I'm out of here. Don't click off yet. Watch this last video. Watch this last clip. It's a doozy.